onto the felt. Adam Geyer has picked up a pair of aces in first position. And now Stefan, who's played very conservatively here at this final table, just calling here with King Queen. Oh, wow. She's got a pair of jacks. This could spell big trouble for Maria here, especially if she three bets right now. She's just calling here, Vent. Brian now looking at the size of that pot, over 550,000 in there. He's just got the four deuce of hearts. It cost him 75,000 more to call, but he's going to do it, and we're going to have four way action. The flop is a 10 9 deuce, all diamonds. Well, Adam, Brian is checked, and Adam is going to make a bet of 300,000. Stefan catching none of that, luckily. I bet she didn't raise pre-flop, so there's no way her opponent's going to put her on her hand this strong. She's going to make the call. Maria has one out to win this pot. Five on the turn, no diamond, and Adam's going to check. She could only catch the jack of hearts to have the best hand. Now the board pairs nines. A little over 1.2 million in the pot, and wow, what a bet. 850,000. How much you have behind? One six. I mean, it's just hand over hand set up. Well, it is certainly a tough decision for her. Um, look at this, Brian. Well, he's called the clock on yep. her. I don't, he says, I'm short, I gotta do it, I feel bad, but. Well, I don't blame him. Time is ticking, yeah, I don't blame him either. Well, that means Maria has one minute to act on her hand. If she does not do so in one minute, her hand will be automatically folded. You'll give me 10 second countdown, right? Yeah. Thanks. They'll count the clock down when it reaches 10 seconds. You better hope the clock runs out. Yeah, that would be nice. I call. Oh, Vincent, oh. she's made the call here, yep. and it's going to cost her 850000